Tiffany screwed me up. Unbelievable. Well, why'd you listen to me? Fired and rehired every no, show. No, you know, you have a record of being fired and rehired. Like, you know, I'm going to start taking uh, <laughs> like a count or something. It's going to be like, uh, I'm going to do the gong sound effect, fired and rehired, ding! <laughs> but, you know... Uh, no, the, the ding is when you're trying to educate your friends on how to not get arrested by the police. How to not get your ass kicked by the police. Police. <laughs> Alright, so... Need with a friend, that, bring a white friend. What? Yeah, you know what, Chris, it was very convenient. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. So when, when that time you got what I got pulled over, you were in the car. How, how's that compared to your normal uh, pullovers? Oh, uh, night sticks. No, no, because military <laughs> man. I, I'm, I'm usually okay. <laughs> I, I'm taking you. We're not surprised when Abnor Lima got his uh, beating. No, that that. <laughs> no comment. Like, really? Did they have to shove a night stick up his rectum? That that was. <laughs> yeah, he has his shit pushed in, bro. <laughs> and the funny thing, him being from Haiti like myself, he, he looked like one of my relatives. I'm like, yo, are you related? <laughs> like, yo, what the heck? Alright, so, well, I'm not the only one from the islands. You got Mr. Trinidad t mm -hmm. over there, so it's all gravy. But, alright, let's get this. Oh, actually, it was recording? What? Alright, so give me one second, audience. I am going to cue the intro. New Game in Order is brought to you by Fullscreen.net. Intro is created by Michael Hurdle, michaelhurdle.com. Make sure you check him out for all your graphical needs. We are the New Game in Order, and let me go back into the room. What's going on, guys? The intro reel is complete, so let's get started with this podcast which i'm having some issues with but uh you're not having issues oh uh, yeah I, I, you know what exploit was was perfect i don't know what the heck happened but i know nelson is working behind the scenes to make sure we're, we're... Uh, alex you look at that image that you just put on the stream the one i sent what the hadoken oh. yeah hey were you are you ken are you ken what have you gone uh mad of course I am. Come on, come closer. Oh, no, you... What the heck? Okay. Oh yeah, I've seen this. <laughs> hey, it's old. I ran into that again this week. That, that that's pretty damn cool. Show you can. <laughs> All right, new game in order. We are the New Jersey Juggernauts. No, actually, there's one Juggernaut, and you got Mitch's. No, this is our what? staff. What? <laughs> what? What? New game in order. Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. Ordinarily, I save that for the end of the show. But with all intended purposes, I'm trying something a little different. And yes, I gotta get this stuff in order. What the hell? I'm like fumbling the ball. Like uh, the Atlanta Falcons. Uh... I'm fucking old. Yeah. Well, I don't even sound like that anymore. Uh, that, was, that was you being a little angry. Yeah, I don't even sound like that anymore. Shut up. You always sound like that. Who are you kidding? You know, it's all gravy. But let's do our introductions. On your knees, what's going on, man? What you been playing besides River City Ransom and Berserk? Uh, I've been playing more Hearts of Iron 4. Um, oh, what else? I picked up CrossCode last night. Mm -hmm. uh, it's another... Uh, what, what the hell is it? The uh, for Never Ending Beta Games on uh, Steam. I played the demo a couple months ago. Uh, it was pretty fun. Yeah. Uh, you know, a 16-bit type of uh, action RPG type of thing. Uh, it's currently on sale. I think it's on sale till Monday, three uh, like three or four bucks off. It's like seventeen dollars, so uh, okay. I recommend it. Mm -hmm. Also, I see got the English dubbing. Uh, I'll probably be doing that some point soon. Mm -hmm. um, and they also got free DLC too. So uh, that, that you got comes a BLT. Sale, so you should check. You hungry? Actually, I could go for a BLT. That beer is very tasty. But I'm having chili later, so uh, I have oh. a chili in the slow cooker right now. It smells very good. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, T Rex, man. I know what you've been playing because I've been doing a lot of the play with you, but I know Colleen has been released. 
And this has been a week of a lot of interesting news. You know, we got a new Street Fighter character. Nintendo Switch released at midnight. You know, mm-hmm. some interesting stuff. But, you know, what's going on, brother? Uh, that's about it. I haven't had the chance to play anything except Street Fighter this, this last week. And that's probably what I'm going to keep doing. Just to grind for a bit more fight money. Just to make sure that I have enough for whenever the next character shows up. But besides that, I, uh... I've just been relearning some tr- tricks with um, editing, being with music, and now video editing. Mm-hmm. So that's what I've been up to lately. Alright, cool, cool, cool. So I'm pretty sure the other staff, uh, Nelson was here and he pulled a Houdini. Like, you know, he's, I think he's being abused, but it's all good. That's an inside joke. Well, oh god. Oh. Really? Really? Uh, that was probably the wrong sound effect, but. I, I keep forgetting where shit is on this thing. I got too many sound effects. Unbelievable. But new game in order. Um, me, Alex Alexis. What I've been up to is doing a lot more active streaming. Uh, I haven't been able to do Warframe this week because uh, taking care of some stuff. My dad's birthday was this week. He turned 72. You know, love my old man. So spent some time with him and all that. That's and, that. and I would say to this, you know. The power of forgiveness is a wonderful thing. Don't hold grudges. Like, it says, going through life with a clench, like, walking around like a clenched fist takes a lot of energy and time and focus away from other things. So just open your heart and learn to forgive. And that goes not just for my family, but like gaming world or professional or relationships within staff and things of like, like, that nature. So with that, Let's get it off and popping. Nintendo Switch news. New Game and Order audience, how many of you have was were out was outside last night waiting for that Nintendo Switch? It was What's cold as hell. Switch? What's in the background? <laughs> Unbelievable. But the Switch is here. It's official. Um, what I plan on doing because I'm still a skeptic. Um, I'm trying to set up with the Hillside GameStop uh, in New Jersey if I can go and record like a play test of uh, the unit. Uh, I believe Best Buy Union uh, Route 22 uh, West uh, may have a kiosk set up but uh, I'll probably go there and actually get my hands on the unit. If I like what I see maybe down the line you know uh, with support from donations and what have you I'll uh, pick it up, but I'm hearing some lukewarm things about it. Some good, some like, oh, they want more out of it. But for the most part, the Switch, hopefully they give you the option of what to get. Because I don't like the colors of the mini controllers, or what are they calling them now? Joy-Cons. The the, the Joy-Cons. I don't like that pink and baby blue color. That's that's whack. There's also gray. Like yeah, I want I, I want the black one if I do indulge in this, you know. And being that Sony burned me with the whole uh, PS Vita or not, I'm kind of afraid to jump in there. But you know, starting with on your knees. What are your thoughts now that the Switch is out? Were you able to see one as of yet? And no, I, I didn't even know it was launching last night. To be honest, that's how how little fucks I give to this. Um, <laughs> you, you know what's funny? You know what's funny? Like Nintendo didn't really like put um, a lot of advertisement out. My remember back in the day, you you would see Nintendo doing like the Mario campaign for like Super Mario Three. You saw all those kids in the different shirts and, and on the face of the planet. And depending on where they are, they were like either part of the eye, part of the the hat, the mustache, the skin. You know, like they the marketing campaigns were a lot stronger back in the day. And was that I, for Super Nintendo or for the N64? No, no, it was it like the 64. no the Mario campaign commercial. Mm-hmm. No, that was Nintendo. We're going further back. We're going uh, further oh, back there. Like, uh, yes, okay then. Nah, yeah. I I, you, know, you don't really need advertising money anymore. I mean, you look at a lot of these games. Sort of and YouTubers about. actually is free advertisement. So yeah, you look at oh, shit. What the hell is it? The um the, the Tomb Raider game. It saw was it five million units because they didn't sell six million units. They said it was a failure because over half their budget was advertising. Uh. So you don't need big advertising anymore. It's all on the internet. Uh, you get you get the YouTube program. Mm-hmm. You're, 
Twitch streamers are going to touch a much larger eight, uh, audience than anything in the, the current mainstream media. Yeah. So uh, that's the way to go. And they they didn't need to make that money because everyone knows this movie's coming mm -hmm. out. I, and, uh, I did, but I'm not interested in it. But the, okay. Nintendo's official channel put a lot of videos during the week. Oh, well, the Nintendo uh, Direct? Um, no, not, not a Nintendo Direct. Just like... Uh, this game is coming out, The Legend of Zelda, The Bomberman, they all got like new um, trailers for mm -hmm. uh, the Switch, Switch's launch. They added a bunch of uh, new trailers because people have been idiots with mm -hmm. like being able to open their uh, Joy-Cons up from the Switch. Mm -hmm. and for some reason, tasting the uh, the cartridges for some reason. So stupid. These yeah. People well, there's a tear. Oh, there's a teardown video it's of, easy. yeah. Uh, well, uh, what was that? Uh, WCCFTech.com uh, actually has a teardown video of the switch. I don't know why they would do that, but there you have it. You know, I, I don't. A lot of people some like some to people do that. like to know, like yeah, what's in what, the the hardware. Yeah, and they could see if they can monitor anything to it. Well, mm -hmm. I I I foresee this being hacked on some level. But well, weren't you saying well, uh, who was saying it was it Nelson was saying earlier that um because the the SD cards are the same shape as the ones for the Vita uh, they think they can uh, hack it oh like way? flash flash the um, what was that flash the cards the ROMs inside yeah and but, play hack games on there well that'd be uh, that'd be when you would want to pick it up there was all, that also may be the reason why the uh, the internet browser isn't coming out on it at launch. It's still they're, they're trying to secure to switch, it, but not a launch. Mm -hmm. Well, I I think I had men made mention of that. Like you know, that's I don't know if it's a big deal, but you know, cell phones have it. The Vita had it. PSP had it. Like you know, but it's then again, that, some console. some of the other stuff like the this uh, DS and the other they didn't have it, right? They had browsers. But well, okay, well, because DS I wasn't mo I didn't really support the the DS. My sister. I don't, I don't yeah, go ahead. I think no. The Wii had a browser. The Wii had a browser. Uh, the Wii U has a browser. The the original DS did have a browser. Mm -hmm. It had um. It, it had, had a, a, a chat app or something. Browser. Like you can buy a browser for it. Mm -hmm. there, and the 3DS browser. has a browser. Okay. Well, you know what? Here's my thing. The price points. Like we have the confirmed price points. Is uh, you have the bundle with no games. And you have the uh, bundle with uh, Breath of the Wild and it a bigger internal storage. I don't know, it, like there, you know those like internal storage. What's that? Oh, you know what I mean the freaking thirty-two. It, it, it's sixteen. No, and... no, that that should be a thing. Yeah, I know that it's All like them have uh, the same amount of storage. Yeah, but I know that you get something with. You know, I'm forgetful. Uh, don't. don't Pay me no mind, but Wait, I Alex, I'm fucking old. Yeah, yeah. I think that's actually <laughs> taking effect. I'm getting up there, but I know that um, with the one bundle with, with Zelda, you're just paying for Zelda with it. It's like you're guaranteeing the fact that you're gonna have it. But yeah, that's that's just GameStop doing that sort of thing, or really doing that sort of thing. But yeah, because mm -hmm. the Nintendo's not making those bundles. Oh, I thought that was a Nintendo thing. No, nah, no. Nah. Uh, well, they're trying to sell those just... units. <laughs> they're trying to get them out there. But yeah, like, people want to like, where's the game bundle with this thing? Well, there you go. Mm -hmm. No one well, said it's going to be cheaper. Here's my thing. On your knees and I were talking before we went live. Like, what's going on with Mario? Like, you would think that Mario would launch with um, the Nintendo Switch. You know. Or the cross uh, console. Well, like, would it be the first time they launched the Nintendo console with that Mario? For me, it's an expectation because whenever I grew up with Nintendo, okay, Matter so fact, I think this is the third console without a Mario launch title. Mm, is Mario taking a back seat or what? No, uh, Mario's coming out it, in the summer. Okay, what, like a Gal away. Galaxy Three or something. Well, I, I think this is the first time the Zelda was a launch title, if I'm not mistaken. I think, at least for the I think Twilight console. Princess for the Wii was a launch title. Mm -hmm. uh, that, no, it Can't wasn't. On that. Okay. No, it wasn't. Um, that one came out a while a while after. No, mm -hmm. Twilight Princess was on um, 
I don't count that because that was a GameCube game. Mm-hmm. If I'm not mistaken. So do you so. count this because this was a Wii U game? It never got released on Wii U. Uh, yeah, it did. But... Breath of the Wild? Sure. That's on Wii U. Wait, wait. Breath of the Wild? I thought this was new. Ah, uh, no. This was technically the Wii U Zelda. Uh-huh. And it, it, it got poured Hold over on. to the Switch eventually. Oh, well, they were originally making it for that, stopped it, and then just put it on this. I, I, is that what you're referring to? Yes, I am. Okay, got it. I, I, I do remember that news. I, I can, you know, co-sign that one. But just overall, like, I don't know. For some reason, this is the first... Actually, not the first time. I'm not really, like, you know breaking my neck to go and get one of these uh systems because you know i don't know nintendo just fell far from grace it's just but don't get me well, wrong I, I i probably will end up with one at, at some point well, down just, the line just just, just to just, have it you know well, i just hope you enjoy buying your season pass for zelda okay yeah uh, okay can you elaborate on that uh yeah i found it i, I we talked off stream i found it on best buy Oh, hold on, I have it here. Mm -hmm. Breath of the Wild There's expansion pass. Yeah, twenty bucks uh, for two contents. Uh, there is a holiday pack coming out, uh, holiday twenty seventeen. So I imagine it's Christmas. And there's the first contact pack coming out this summer. Do you have it in we'll the put, Discord? Uh, no, I'll put it there in a moment. Yeah, so we can actually hold on. There you go. Right off uh, the Best Buy website. Right. Uh, so first contact pack will have. The addition of a Cave of Trials challenge, new hard mode, a new feature for the in-game map. That does, that sounds very worthwhile. Uh, uh, Sleepy Jim, Mario Kart isn't out on this system yet. I, uh, think I don't count Mario Kart, Kart as a launch on. title either. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't remember. Uh, I don't Kart. count it as a Mario title, but it stands on its own. The Mario Kart game is just, it's just I can't only... think of a bad Mario Kart game, but they're, um, it's not a Mar uh, what we call a Mario game, or at least the way I, what I would mm -hmm. call one. Alright, so Nintendo has DLC, so pretty much $10 a pack for mm -hmm. the expansion. And the, you know what's funny? All that expansion stuff is already complete. They just piece out the game to you, so like that, that practice I is... I don't know, because they... With the exception of like Street Fighters and the Warcrafts and, you know, uh, game, but this, is, this is not an online game. You know what no, I mean? No, but I, I'm not sure because Mario Kart was finished for some time and then they made DLC for it. And yeah. that was also the case with Splatoon. Mm -hmm. Where they wasn't sure it was going to sell and where it sold really, really well. Oh, those, th that's special different cases, but I know they know no. it sells is going to sell. Well, what happened is that they schedule DLC into the production cycle. Mm -hmm. So they make, they make, we want to have X, XYZ in the game. Okay, XYZ is complete. Even if it's before the launch date, okay, we can start working on, you know, RST now. And, you know, we can work on H HIJ, you know, that sort of shit. Mm -hmm. So, it's, it's the schedule into the production cycle of the game. So, it's not really pre-made in most cases because you might have, uh, there might be some cosmetic stuff as day one DLC. But that's because, you know, hey, we finished ahead of schedule. What can we do to, you know, kill some time? Oh, here, let's make some new costumes or some shit like that. So okay. that, that I'm, twenty dollars for with, an uh, expansion pass. So the game is technically, if it's sixty dollars for the game, it's eighty bucks. Yeah, yeah. So that's not that's not that bad for a pass, but you got to see how much contact comes with it. Uh, I'll be uh, as much as I want to shit on Nintendo having DLC, twenty bucks isn't the worst we see. Yeah. Uh, it's great. Uh, it's only two packs, but as long as it gives, maybe. I'm but um, T Rex, what's the season pass rate for Street Fighter Five? I, I couldn't tell you. Wait, yeah. wait, I, wait, wait, I think I have something for that here. Hold on. Oh, shit, where is it? 599 US dollars. Yeah. yeah. Nah, that's, more, that's more DOA at this point. <laughs> you know you what? You gotta lower that number a bit. The what? I, I'm not I'm talking about Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> that's that's <laughs> more like DOA. <laughs> but I'm looking at this teardown video. And just it just in parts. Hopefully we don't get snagged for it. Like this thing really. Mm, that's the internal battery. For mm -hmm. a uh, three um, point seven volt. For uh, forty three ten m uh, ah battery. Now here's the thing. Now you know Nintendo charges you to replace that battery, right? If something like what should go wrong with it. 
And if you open it, you void the warranty. Ain't that some stuff? Like, yeah. come on, Nintendo. Like, fix that policy. Uh, two things here. I have an explanation of what they do with their DLC. And two, uh, Playboy wants to be in on this. No, no. he, Mr. Poverty Box? Yeah, said, yeah. Playboy, what the heck do you want? Hello? Hey. NYG, uh, NYC J boy, what's going on? Welcome to the show, man. If you don't, if you 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 <laughs> dick riding hookers. If you don't get what? off of that shit, buying, spending hundreds of dollars for some bullshit that's not even fully up and running yet. You guys are good ones right now. Well, hey, look, I didn't buy it. I didn't buy it. None of us bought it here. You know, huh? we're just looking. You know, here's the thing. Nintendo's out. This is more like a glorified PSA, you know, the good, bad, and the ugly. My intentions are to actually get hands-on with this um, in the near future. You know, hopefully I can do it sometime this week for you guys. But those of you who do have the Switch, and shout out to one of my battle buddies. I went to um, MRT training with him in um, Fort Jackson, South Carolina. He picked up the Switch, and that's my shout out to you. That's our first class. So, um... I, you know, I had to give him a shout out, but like I'm gonna put this on the New Gaming Order Facebook page. But I just uh, want to collect some feedback from you guys that actually have the console, you know. So I just want to see. But Playboy, what you're seeing in the background on the stream is that's the battery that Nintendo is gonna charge you. I, I forget what the the price is to replace that battery. No, wrong answer. Wrong freaking answer. <laughs> no way. Look at that. The, the way that they opened the system, you can do it yourself. Yeah. Do it yourself. How much are they say... going to charge you? What, how, what, are, uh, what are they charging you for? Uh, Hold on. Can somebody pull that up for me? Well, because if I switch... I don't actually know about that information, but I could try. Yeah, the, uh, uh, Reggie feels to me. Uh, uh, what was it? Stone Fox Media had put that out. And, and uh, some other folks. But I'm like, no way. You're not gonna charge me for like. Let me go back a little bit. Yeah, the 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 switch is pretty much built around screws and pins. Yeah, can easily be re removed and switched around. Because it looks like over time that battery will go bad. It will go bad. Oh. It's inevitable. It's a consumable yeah. Every piece of the device. Battery eventually goes bad. Yeah. But like with the the what was that the the play time for it like. Uh, three out or six hours, something like that, or less. Yeah, it's six hour battery. It's a six hour battery for it to be a handheld. To be a handheld. Because uh, uh, well, the for the unit itself, it's like six hours, and for the controllers, it's about uh, ten or twenty. Well, uh, for the Joy Cons, well, they have batteries well, in, in in there themselves, right? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Well, the um, well the uh, well, CNET did a a thorough. <laughs> review of it. I really don't put much stock in the CNET, but they went, they went deep in it. I'm like, well, yeah. tell us about it. Tell us about it because this is just like a two-parter. They, 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 they were like, they, they were like, well, they're like me. They're like, okay, it's, it's, it's cute and everything, but it's, it's all the online services are not up and running. You know, and that's why they're not advertising it yet because you know everyone's talking about. Well, why don't they advertise? Because all the services are not up and running. You can't put this thing out on TV, put a commercial. Oh, well, and then by why the did way, they release it? Like, oh, couldn't they wait? Oh, and by the way, you know, we're not going to have stuff ready till the fall of 2017 at the earliest, if that. You know what? I think they're trying to avoid um, going up on the release against the Scorpio, which is going to be the next um, thing uh, we discuss. But damn. Uh. But why release it? Like you know what? That's like what happened with Street Fighter Five. They released the game before it was ready. They're releasing yep. a console before it's ready. Mm -hmm. well, and I don't even want to call this a console. The, the console and, and you and you get a and you get a HDMI cable or something. Yeah, um, for the docking to, station. Yeah, to go to your television. It's crazy. Oh, but yeah, uh, T Rex. So yeah. What were you saying? Okay, I was asking. So what? What more do you want out of the the unit then? There more are, than this. Well, 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 no, no, what no, 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 What just Playboy what? just said? No, I'm, I'm curious. Yeah, what, what Playboy just said? Like, if their services aren't up and running, 
it's like, but then again, Microsoft was somewhat guilty of this, but they didn't know that Xbox Live was going to become a thing. You know, they released the console and then they added the service thereafter. You know, when it became like online gaming, and they were the first to bring it. Well, actually, Sega well, was the first let, to bring let, it to let, the console. Let, 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 well, this this, yeah, this, this, this is this is Dr. Dana's hat is on right now. All right, hold on, hold on. Still yeah. right now. Well, let me tell you. Okay, for okay, terrorists. Okay, Te hey, what you know, the heck? Hey, hey, hey. Okay, your launch titles. You got what four? You got Zelda. I actually want what's more out of the you and a lot out of the games. The games no, are I'm, understandable. I mean, well, yes, well, you don't, you don't even, you games. don't, you, you don't even have a great library first and foremost. You know, uh, okay, you know, what are your IPs? I'm surprised they didn't have a, a any kind of Mario release. Well, we said this you know, before yeah, you came yeah, on. I like, I just, yeah, I just put the list in that this. Oh, one, those are the launch titles. Oh, All right, oh let me, well let me then, get it. well then, um, see, rest of your hooker. That's all. That, that's your and comeback? What the heck? Yeah. I asked, yeah. what do you want my, oh, more out of the unit? Like, does he want more power out of it? That's the kind of question I'm asking. Not what games does he want out of it. Uh, we're all the way here that doesn't have much games. If if any that people... But that's a, the most important thing, okay, though. That's who, who are who are they advertising? Who Who is the target audience for this console? Who, who, who? Well, who? They're, they're saying, what, um, what, 16 to 35? Young adults. Yeah. You know, then it's not really for kids. You know what I mean? But uh, kids nowadays, wow. like, you know, they're getting and, more and adept to more technology. To, to let their, their, their kids buy a Nintendo console than anything else. It's, it's always been a safe bet to give your child a, a Nintendo console. Mm hmm. Wait, you, you know you what? Know. Hold on. Mm -hmm. uh, Slinky Jim for Extreme Gamers for a premium price. Like elite controller, I don't think I follow. If you can rephrase that for me, that'd be great. Well, he's saying he's saying the price point for those controllers, like they want seventy nine dollars for the pro controller. That that's too much. Controller, I'm like, what the? Mm -hmm. All right, your dog. The Scorpio. Uh, mm. Who is? Texting me, all these broads to leave me alone. Oh, oh, thank you. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Something happened. What happened? Did we lose Alex? Yeah, Alex. No, I'm still here. Sorry about that. No. Um. Okay, so let me get back into to bring this one down. Yeah, seventy. They want seventy bucks for that pro controller. God damn it. You know what? Really? Can you put a link for me so I can? Because this way I can uh, put it in the background for you guys. Yeah, seventy bucks. Seventy. Uh, incoming. There it is. All right, got it. Oh snap! That's a lot. Mm -hmm. But you know what? The elite controller for Xbox is pretty up there though. Mm -hmm. But that's a premium controller, so. But you know what, um, Slinky Jim, we don't have the price of the Scorpio yet. We'll find out June eleventh once they, you know, start talking about the, uh, you know, uh, some of the details to the system. <laughs> but this is a straight ripoff of a Xbox controller, though. Well, which is based off the old SNES controller. What do you do? Like this is the the layout that the uh, this is a standard GameCube, that the GameCube had as well, plus with a extra uh, bumper. Wait, you know what? Do they have like the top top down view? Um, I had a picture. If you give me a second. Yeah, because there's it's in essence in a 360 controller. I'm gonna see if I can get this picture. <laughs> because look. Look at my Elite, right? If you uh, look at on. this, that's pretty much the same thing as what you're looking at I here. I'll just put it in Discord for you. Alright. It's like the same thing. But don't get me wrong, like, it gets to a point where what can they do to be different? Right, Alex. And, um, have you ever seen a Wii U Pro controller? Wii U? No. I will show you one right now. This is what the Wii U Pro Controller looked like, mm -hmm. and no one was having this. Because 
at this point, what can you do? PlayStation has the both at the bottom. Uh, the Xbox has the asymmetrical one at, one at the top and one at the bottom. Yeah. And when the Wii U wanted to do two at the top, nobody liked this design. So they went back to the old GameCube style design. Well, you know what? It just, I don't well, know, something happened where the standard is pretty much... Well, I don't hate this yeah. one, don't get me wrong, but it's just, Very now wrong. we, I think the, the controllers have reached a plateau, like, I don't think people in this day and age are going to be um, accepting to change when it comes to how to, you know, handle your characters on screen, you know, so. Well, well, the one, the one issue with the, with the Joy-Con controller, my bobber thingy, mm -hmm. if you have really, if you have big hands like me, it's really awkward. So that's why they charging you eighty dollars for that um, switch controller. Well, the, so the be, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. See that right there? That the one in the Discord? The, that's the one that is on Alex's screen right there. Mm -hmm. People with large hands cannot. It it's it it, it doesn't work. So yeah, even and, that guy in the picture has large hands, and you see how tiny that thing is. Yeah, it's yeah. made for Japanese, man. It's made for Japanese, but with I that, need for my, I need something for my big fat American hands. Yeah, Chris actually looks like Review Tech USA. <laughs> God damn it! I was wondering when you were gonna say that, you motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> I was they waiting have, for that for weeks. They, they had the same hands, like sausage hands, but you know it's all love, God brother. Damn it, Alex! What? You I'm, I'm, I'm old. <laughs> That's right. It's it's finally good. You're finally getting back at me. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Aside from saying I look like the senator for fucking Metal Gear. Well, you do. Jesus Christ. Oh. All right. Oh, another bit of news with the Switch. If you're using like a save on one console, you cannot transfer it to another. Um, here. Currently, anyway. Yeah. Here is the info on that. Nintendo Switch stores cards cannot transfer between consoles. Why are they calling this a console? I don't know. It's it's something else. I think they're gonna have to reclass this as a whole new technology. It's a Turk sandwich. Well, aren't, aren't, aren't the saves stored on micro SD cards? What what the hell? Well, it looks like they're trying to keep it like you have to reinitialize it each time you use it on another system. Or well, reformat it. Yeah. Reformat it. Yeah. Well, the, as it says here, and let me zoom in a little bit. The, just the, explain to them, Alex, how it works like it does on the Super Nintendo. It's the exact same what thing. the heck? Who, who this? Oh, that's Nelson? <laughs> oh, you back? Well, temporarily, I gotta go soon, but explain Shut to them up. how it's the same proprietary save system as it is on the Super Nintendo when they dump the ROM from the cart mm -hmm. and it's temporarily saved. Mm -hmm. and they want to take it out, it can possibly get deleted. This time around, they can have it stored to the console as a primary source. Mm. And if you're trying to use it to a different console, they would just erase. Mm. Yeah, huh. I was going to explain that, but thanks. Well, Nelson stole T-Race's fire, but the micro no, 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 SD no, no. card is being right used now. by another Nintendo Switch console or was used on this console before it was initialized. Delete the Nintendo Switch data on the micro SD card to use it on this console. Save data, screenshots, and other data not related to the Nintendo Switch won't be deleted. You can remove the micro SD card if you don't want to use this on your console. That's, you know, uh, source from GameRant.com. Nintendo Switch stores transfer. So, there you have it. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that, but. Well, we don't know if this is, a, is going to be a permanent thing. This might just be something temporary as they uh, release oh other updates to my consoles, God. Just this like they do with so the Xbox. Amateurish. Like the it is, it's not going to be a temporary thing. What kind of R&D did they put into this? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Uh, hey, Playboy, you alright? <laughs> what happened? What's going on? <laughs> it, it, it's... it's it, 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 I'm sorry. It's a poppy box. Uh, just to, explain. To, just to, just to say it. It's a poppy yeah. box. I am. I'm sorry, T. Rex. Please forgive me. I am so no, sorry. No, no, no. Well, what's going on no, here? You have, you have valid points. It's I mean, you you you, you 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 expensed millions of dollars in R and D. Um, well, this was the razor, the and, portable and, and, razor. And and, and 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 this is what you get. You know, you can't move. Say, in this age of <laughs> digital 
Calm down. Fuck Use your words, technology man. Technology and everything. <laughs> And and you gotta get a third party S micro SD card to go into the Switch. Okay, I want I wanna save my my Zelda game or what my multiplayer game, what that what what the hell ever. I wanna play it on my cousin's uh uh switch in Ohio or whatever. He has a switch. I just saved my game so I had to bring my switch. You know, I pop my thing in there on my say I got you know. Oh oh there's no words. No. Yeah, you would lose okay. your saves if I, I don't yes, know. You it's... lose everything. Ugh. So bas you basically, it's it's pretty much anchored to those SD cards. You know what I mean? And then wherever you go, like it's like they want you to bring that switch with you. Is, is there is there an, uh, is there a cloud service at least something? I was gonna ask is, that. I was is, gonna is ask there that. A Dropbox. Um, Nintendo currently uh, has nothing like that at the moment. So uh, no. Uh, Jesus. So what, Wait, hold on, online, hold what, on. What kind of online service? What, 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 what did the Wii U? What, what did what did the Wii U have? What what um what was that online Nintendo's service? Never, they played Nintendo's games Nintendo's online. Never had a thing like that. Nintendo's never had a uh, cloud store. Uh, oh, they played Jesus. games online. Well, that Microsoft oh, started God. that with consoles. Oh, Jesus Christ. Well, uh, <laughs> in the console space. <laughs> no, 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 like what didn't uh, who started that like? It was Xbox. Yeah, Microsoft started you know that for consoles. PC already had that, but yeah. we're, we're talking you know console. What? You know what I see? I see someone like um, who was it? Who makes those accessories? Was it? Is it Nyko or Mad Cat? They go come up. They go come up with an accessory where you can move your saves between. No, no, I don't think. That I know it, they are. I know they are. They it, they gonna have something because this somebody's this, gonna do it. Well, they, or they're gonna <laughs> hack uh, it. Like the game shot. People yeah, it's a this is a it. software this is a software fix right here. This this mm -hmm. yeah, it's not that complicated. Yeah, that's this so. is built in. They're trying to do something stupid, like they're trying to prevent <laughs> save sharing or some shit when there's no need for it. It's not an online game where you're gonna do items or some shit. Who so cares I don't know about that... save sharing? Who are we, we, we... It's not like you're the, the game and sitting there because they, they, they can fix it because this was a feature that was on the Wii at first and they removed it with the update. Hmm. You could you could sh switch your shares your game shares out on the Wii with an SD card. Yeah. You can download game saves with an SD card, mm -hmm. and eventually over time, Nintendo was like, "Nah, actually play your games," and they removed the feature to switch out your game saves from the SD card mm -hmm. on the original Wii. All right, well, so they could easily put that back in if they want to. They can uh... never fix it at all. All right. Well, I mean, in general, the switch is out. You just love pieces of information according to, you know, minor research with it. But oh, in other news, if Nelson is still with us, what's up he with is. your boy Triforce? Oh, he's oh. muted. Okay. Well, uh, Isaiah Triforce Johnson. Uh, I don't know, man. This guy literally, he legally changed his name to Triforce. Okay? What? Yeah, he legally changed his name to Triforce. And he's out what, there. What, what is CND? I, Canada? Well, I, well, CND is someone else, apparently. Yeah, well, a, a person. Yeah, so I guess he's. Oh, Captain Nintendo, dude. Oh. Oh, I'm not familiar with him. Okay. Well, really? Well, no, anyway, he's out there. I, I, I mean, this has nothing to do. It's just the fact that Nintendo Switch is involved with it, but he helps the man stand in line to get his unit. So, I'm not even going to go into this, but it's, I find that kind of odd. But it's whatever. Is, 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 is there, is, are they, are they, is, is Triforce, didn't, don't Nintendo on the, on the, copyright to the, to, the, to the Triforce as in Zelda? Yeah, of course. So... then You know how Nintendo is. I like his yeah, hat, though. Nintendo's are, Nintendo is an asshole company. That's why I'm like, hmm. Cease did they desist. send him a letter? Like, hey, you can't change your name. Well, it's, not, mean, it's now like legal documents. That's well, his name. If, 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 if Robin Williams can name his daughter Zelda, I'm pretty sure this is fine. Oh. Oh, that's right. I do. I do know a Zelda at work. Oh yeah. Never mind. Uh, yeah. That's that from the record. And the name was originally gotten from F. Scott Fitzgerald's wife, if I'm not mistaken. Mm -hmm. Her name was Zelda too. Uh, ah. Way okay. back in the day. Well. And 
Let's go that. Nelson, okay. come back. What? Say again? <laughs> I need Nelson to chime in on this. Oh well, I mean, oh. for time's sake. So, 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 so the news is he stands in line. Okay. What? Well, okay. People who buy crapple do that all the time. Wow. You know what? New game of order. We're going into intermission. Make Juice. sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. Check us out on newgameorder.com for the latest and greatest. Join us for our second half of this podcast where we're going to be talking about the uh, Microsoft Netflix style service that will be offered to Xbox One owners and PC. So uh, stay tuned for our director's cut. Uh, stick around in the chat. You'll get to hear some of the faux pas that goes on between segments. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.